What is something in your life that is super fucking awesome? I had the same best mate since we were 3 years old. Until we got to 21. And her new abusive man cut off all contact between us. I searched for her on and off for 11 years and we finally found each other after she left him in. October last year, he nearly killed her. Stabbed multiple times. Anyways, she's healing now and when we met up for the first time in a decade we skipped to each other like the three-year-olds we were when we first met. It's like we were never apart. I feel like I won the lottery. Fuck yeah, friendship rocks. My marriage, 38 good years and getting better. Hell yeah, marriage, I got a raise yesterday. Fuck yeah, more money rules. I think he means he got a boner. Fuck yeah, I love boners. I live 10 minutes from a small but fun ski mountain. Fuck yeah is it winter yet? Fuck yeah, winter sports. I finally have a stable job. Edit. I'm not sure if some of the comments are sarcastic or not. But I could have worded this a little better. I meant I have a secure job for a very long time that will be able to pay my schooling. Although I do like horses haha. Thanks for all the words of encouragement. Fuck yeah, job security. I love your fucking enthusiasm sir keep being you man. Fuck yeah, fuck yeah, staying true to yourself rocks. Yesterday the CEO of the company I work for pledged to donate $4,000 I need for a surgery to save my I edit. Important note, insurance in the US doesn't cover the operation at all so it's not the CEO's fault for providing bad insurance. I haven't gotten bitten by a mosquito for the past 5 or 6 years. Don't know why, I can be in a group of people in which everyone else is getting torn up. And they don't even look at me. Fuck yeah, immune to mosquitoes. I found a dollar in my jacket. Fuck yeah, finna buy me some meths. Exclamation mark. Hell yeah, meth is amazing. Wait, I'm in Hawaii all month. Edit in Oahu. Staying in Waikiki, Ala Moana area. Fuck yeah, Hawaii. Hashtag A L O H A M U T H A F U C K A. Exclamation mark. I went back to college this past spring after two years of depression and drug addiction. My little brother and sister are becoming awesome people and I'm so lucky for having them. Fuck yeah, I love gratitude. Also I have awesome pants. Exclamation mark, exclamation mark. Fuck yeah, awesome pants are awesome. The love that I feel from my students each workday. I work in an elementary school. And I feel really grateful to have found a job that I love so much. Sometimes I wake up feeling down. But once I step into my workplace and see even one of my students, my morning lights up. This is one of my favorite examples of how loved I feel. Student, what age do I have to be to be able to go wherever I want? Me, I think you can pretty much do anything you want once you're 18. Student, how old will you be when I'm 18? Me, hmm, monsieur, 35. Student, when I'm 18 and you're 35. Can we have dinner together and see each other sometimes? I almost teared. She might not even remember me when she's 18. But just the thought of her caring so much brings me so much joy. Elementary teachers are remembered. I can still remember all of their last names and can picture them in my head. And I'm 30. I have a cat and a dog. Hell yeah that's fucking awesome. Can I hire you as my hype man? Op is the fucking goat. I found a bomb ass apartment in my favorite city with my boyfriend and it's cheap as fuck. Can I live with you guys? This thread. Hell yeah, this thread rules. Asterisk you asterisk rock. I bitch and moan about my job but, being honest, it's really fulfilling and pays the bills. Plus some extra, for my wife and I. So that's pretty goddamn sweet if you ask me. Fuck yeah. Security is badass. I kicked cancer's ass. Edit holy shit. Thanks for the gold. Exclamation mark. I got a new place that is an A asterisk mega cheese asterisk apartment. Fuck yeah. Apartments that aren't shitty rock. My pet dog smiley face.
Hell yeah, pets rock. Fuck yeah, pet rocks. Edit, ooh a shiny one. Thanks, my wife and my son. If I think too hard about how much they mean to me and how lucky I am to have them in my life I feel like crying. I love my wife too. We just found out we're pregnant. I'm crying a little right now. Edit. We agreed we wouldn't tell anyone yet so I told nearly 5,000 strangers on the internet. She wasn't mad though. She's really great. Thanks for the gold. All these years trying to be funny and it turns out sincerity is the true road to gold. Found a 50 euros note in my passport when I went to make sure it was still valid for my upcoming trip. Great dude yourself from the past. Fuck yeah. Fuck yeah. I love questions. Fuck yeah fuck yeah. Fuck yeah. I love saying things twice. Fuck yeah. How about thrice. Fuck yeah. Pushing the envelope rocks. Asterisk asterisk sobriety. Asterisk asterisk. I haven't had alcohol in 1986 days. According to my badge at R, stop drinking. Even better is the chance to advise and support people who are also making the journey into recovery. Started college. Fuck yeah. Education. Op in this post. Fuck yeah. Op rules. Wait you're the op though. Promoting self-love. My pelvic floor muscles after four children. Fuck yeah, pelvic children. I somehow imagine them all looking like Elvis. My six-year-old daughter is the greatest and only thing that is keeping me going. She is awesome. Fuck yeah, daughters are awesome. Getting back home today after traveling around Europe on a tight budget. Hell yeah, home sweet home. Today is my wedding day. Wish me luck everybody. Edit. Wow just logged in the next day and saw a bunch of you wished me luck. It was one of the best days of my life if not the best in my eyes it went perfectly and wouldn't ask for a better day. My wife was beautiful and I cried when I first saw her walking down the aisle. Guys don't be afraid to cry. It's a good emotion. Thanks again to everyone who wished me a happy day in marriage I hope you all had an awesome day. 2. My wife. Hell yeah, dude. Your wife rules. I know. Fuck yeah. I would also like to say this guy's wife rules. Fuck yeah. Also saying stuff rules. Hell yeah it does. Op and everyone reading this. Edit. And the super kind and awesome redditors asterisk that gilded this comment. Hell yeah. Op and everybody reading this rocks. My cat was angry at me because I accidentally stepped on her tail but then I played Billie Jean for her and she started purring saying fuck yeah or saying something rocks fuck yeah saying fuck yeah fucking rocks this guy man he's the super fucking awesome thing in my life right now after almost 21 years of being committed to a cult i finally broke free a few months ago almost daily i get to experience and learn new things about the world especially through music movies and meeting new people my mind gets opened more and more. Sometimes I drive to work in my boat. Edit. As my username suggests. First am a marine systems tech and am lucky enough to live on the same river as my marina job. I just choked on my water and didn't die. My little brother and my older brother. Hell yeah, brothers kick ass. My 8 pound dog got hit by a car last night but he came out with only a cracked rib and a broken tooth. He's a badass. Paid off my student loans yesterday. My four-month-old slept past 4.30 a.m. this morning. I get homesick a lot and often forget that I have been given a real fantastic life adventure. I moved to France and live with a pretty awesome man. Zoxo baby I love you. I know you're reading this. It is super fucking awesome that I live in this incredible country with a sexy French dude that can correctly identify random unmarked cheese on a plate. Edit. My top comment of all time. Thanks for all the responses everyone and for sharing some laughter with me. Hell yeah, French dudes. I like that his cheese spotting skills are among the main things you value in high monsieur. Apple picking this afternoon. Gonna bake a bunch of small apple pies. My dog. 
everyone's dog. Yeah, edit, asterisk asterisk all dogs asterisk asterisk. Fuck yeah, dogs everywhere. All of you motherfuckers celebrating happy shit in your life woo. Everything is awesome. Everything is cool when you're part of a team as your. Everything is awesome. When we're living our dream. Fuck yeah, live in the dream, baby. Fuck. Fuck yeah, fuck it up. You. Fuck yeah, I'm awesome. Thought. At 34, that my years of finding something, one stable were probably behind me. Made my peace with it. Moved to a new city this year with a well-paying job and expected to just work and spend a lot of time by myself. Took our controller. I'm an IT director. Out for dinner one night just to thank her for being so kind to me when I was having trouble. Adjusting to the change. We're getting married in December. I have friends now. And I'm finally smart for my age. And there's a small chance that I get a girlfriend in the following weeks. Yeah. Fuck yeah, having people there to support you rocks! Exclamation mark. My daughter. Two-year-olds have their moments. But fuck me she is cute. She is starting to talk in full sentences so we can actually have a two-way conversation. It's great, and she is funny. She actually tries to make jokes which blows my mind. She has started singing too which is cute AF. She is so affectionate too. Full of hugs and kisses. I got my first I love you mummy the other day that damn near killed me. Yeah, kids are super fucking awesome. But only your own. The rest are kinda meh. My awesome baby. Fuck yeah, your baby rules. I'm starting to text a girl and things are going well. I don't know if she likes me romantically or as a friend but I'm excited to be texting someone. After years of thinking I would be forever alone. I got a fucking date with a girl, who's not paid to interact with me. While cleaning out my basement, I found the box of all the love letters my boyfriend wrote me while he was away at college in the 1990s. They are so romantic, so poetic, so vulnerable and honest they made me feel so loved and so special. Reading them again made me feel like my heart was just brimming over. So I went upstairs and gave that guy a kiss, we've been married 19 years. Dude, my daughter is insanely awesome. She's 18, autistic, and just graduated from high school. Now she's in the 18 to 21 program for special needs young adults. She is kicking its ass. I recently got into a relationship and I have lost roughly 22 kilograms. Life is going amazingly at the moment. I'm getting married today, exclamation mark, exclamation mark, you pump me up up. At 27 years old, I'm going to be making over 200k this year. I think it's pretty awesome because I'm a first generation college student. My dad was a janitor and mom is a waitress. Who got a full ride scholarship so no, dead either. People who are not overly enthusiastic. Fuck yeah. Personal preferences are great. A, they're okay. Hash hashtag F-U-C-K-Y-E-A-H. Op taking the time out of his day to respond to every single comment in this entire thread. Don't at me. I just took a massive dump and feel so much better. I've stopped self-harming smiley face. I'm one of those PPL who can eat a lot and won't get fat. This thread is super fucking awesome. Plus it's Saturday and I've been looking forward to today. And doing nothing. All week. Today is me and my boyfriend's one year clean off of a hardcore years long IV meth habit. Point one fucking. Year today baby. We're both fat now but feel so damn amazing. He went through losing his mom. November 29th. And I was so scared it would tempt him to use but it didn't. We've been through hell and back dot and let me tell ya, this side of the mountain is so much better. I've been off painkillers for 10 days after being on them for about 10 years. I'm in medical school learning the shit I've wanted to learn my whole life. It's pretty satisfying. Literally nothing. Fuck yeah, nothing is great. Me too. Hell yeah, nothing at all. My first son was born two days ago. Holy moly that breaks the scale of awesome.
I'm fucking in love. After going through a divorce a few years ago, I didn't think it would ever happen again. Butterflies. Mourning over each other. The works. Awesome. Thank you so much for watching and have a good day.